Welcome to Fix It. Um, we're going to do a uh, quick tutorial on the Firefox web browser, uh, how to download and install it, and also how to install one of the many add-ons that are available, in this case one called Adblock Plus. Um, most of people are familiar with the Windows Internet Explorer browser, which uh, this one is here. Uh, now we recommend uh, switching to Firefox, and I'll explain the reason why in just a second. Firstly, we have to download the product. We're going to put in Firefox in the uh, Google toolbar, uh, Google search bar up here, and takes it to the Mozilla page, uh, the producer of uh, the Firefox web browser. Uh, click the free download button. And we're going to save that to our desktop. Now, there's some key reasons why we recommend uh, Firefox over Internet Explorer. Firstly, it's faster. It's going to load those web pages uh, that you're going to be clicking on and, and viewing uh, quickly. Um, secondly, it's a more secure product. Uh, malware, spyware, adware uh, isn't going to be so much of a problem. And thirdly, is the customization. Uh, within Firefox, um, you've got a choice of over, I think the number is up to 6,000 different uh, add-ons which allow you to customize the web browser uh, to your tastes. Um, each one of these programs adds a little bit of extra uh, functionality so you can build an environment that's much, much more powerful. I'm just going to download the standard installation and away we go. Um, of those many thousands of uh, add-ons, uh, I know of a dozen I use, um, maybe half of those. Uh, in addition to Adblock Plus, um, which, which functionality is, is pretty simple, what it does is exactly as it's named, it, it deletes um, all the ads on the web pages that you'll be visiting. And that does two things. Firstly, it doesn't just, it, those are, ads are no longer there, so they don't distract you. Uh, and secondly, because those elements are now no longer downloaded and displayed, that's what uh, 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 loads the, uh, the web page, uh, the web page more quickly. Now we've got the option of installing um, data like bookmarks from Internet Explorer. We're not going to go that. I'll have Opera installed, but uh, we're just going to keep this nice and clean. Some of the other add-ons that uh, I use are uh, Gmail Manager, which gives me a, a quick link into my Gmail program. Uh, from my web browser, I can see how many uh, unread um, uh, emails I have in my inbox. Better Gmail 2, which provides some extra functionality, um, colorful tabs, and a few others. We'll go through all of those in a later, later date, perhaps. Now, here's the, uh, the main uh, web page. What we're going to do here is just grab the icon for the Welcome to Gmail, put it up here. This is the quick bookmarks link. So if I want to come back to this page at some later point, I can just click on it here. Also, right-click to create a new tab. Now, Add-ons, so there's a couple of ways to get into add-ons. An easy way is to go to Tools, Add-ons, and you've got various choices here, further customization you can do, but get add-ons and browse all. I'm going to search for Adblock Plus. Add to Firefox. and then restart. Okay, we're actually not going to restart right now. We're also going to put this one, this add, search add-ons up here on the quick launch bar. Now we can restart. Okay, there's one thing left to do with Adblock Plus, uh, and that is configure it. The product is now installed. Uh, we have a choice of different subscriptions. These are uh, listings of the elements that we want to block. Uh, so in here, uh, the easier uh, list USA is as is good as any. Uh, and a second one here for, uh, for France as well, but uh, I don't visit too many French websites. I'm going to subscribe to that. And it's done now. We'll give you an example of <clears throat> the difference. <coughs> we 
ad block plus up here in the corner. And if we scroll down the page, we've got this big blank area here, which is where the advertising used to be. I'm just going to turn this off and refresh it. If we scroll down again. Of all this extra advertising, which we're now no longer viewing when we have the Adblock Plus turned on. We hope you give uh, Firefox a try. Uh, in a later video, we'll go through maybe a couple of the other uh, add ons that we use, and um, uh, we hope you uh, have enjoyed this video.